Hey Facebook friends and possibly Twitter friends if I put this on Twitter. Um, today is World Diabetes Day as some of you might know and um, for me it's a day about raising awareness for what people with diabetes type 1 or type 2 go through on a day to day basis. So as I have type 1 um, I can tell you about what it's like to live with type 1 diabetes and I thought that Instead of writing about how I check my blood sugars, I would do a little video. I've never done a video before, so it's probably going to be awful. Um, but my washing machine's just stopped, so I thought I'd better get it done now before it starts making noises again. So this is my blood sugar kit, which I take everywhere with me. Um, and it's an AccuCheck Aviva combo because it works with my insulin pump. I don't know where this guy's come from. Um, I just found him one day. I have no idea. I didn't like find him on the street. I don't do that. But um, I found him a while ago and I've kept him ever since. And you're supposed to do, it's got a needle inside it. I don't know if you can see that. But it's got the needle inside it that pricks my fingers when I want to check my blood sugars. And you're supposed to change the needle every couple of days. And um, I can honestly say I haven't changed that needle in probably well over a year. And because I don't know where this has come from, I don't want to say to my doctors, I just, I just got this a Lancet and I haven't changed its needle in a year. Can you tell me which Lancets I need? And I'm too embarrassed. Anyway, it works. And if it stops working, then I've got like nails and hammers, which I can use instead. I'm kidding. I don't do that. So, this is my little blood glucose machine, and we just turn them on. It's very clever. Check. Okay, so it gives you a lot of different options, but I'm going to do a blood glucose test. And it's telling me to put a test strip in the bottom of the machine. So I think I will. like this and then it tells you to match the strip up with the code on the top but you don't need to do that anymore and um, then it's telling me to put some blood on the bottom of the test strip so you pull this back put it on your finger and fire it doesn't hurt like when you check your blood sugars about four to eight times a day, it doesn't, you don't even feel it because you've got fingers made of steel. Okay, so put the blood on the bottom of the test strip. Suck off the blood. Oh, my favourite blood sugar. 6.9! Brilliant! I'm not going to tell you why that's my favourite blood sugar. I'm sure many of you can figure it out for yourselves, but I'm pretty happy with that one. Okay, um, so that's it. Like, I do that about four to eight times a day. If I'm sick, then I need to do it more. If I'm exercising, which is very rare, then I need to do it more often. If I'm going out driving, um, before I go to bed, I do it. When I wake up, before I'm going to eat, after I've eaten. Um, so yeah. And I will keep doing that until either a cure for diabetes is found or there's a less invasive way of doing it. I can hear my phone going off now. Excellent timing. Um, so I'll speak to you later. Bye!